So, uh, so I'm William Felty. I'm a Marine Corps veteran, uh, OEF, OIF, um, deployed to Iraq in 2006. Um, since uh, since I've gotten since I got out of the Marine Corps in 2007, I've been dealing with uh, upper back pain and neck pain. Uh, I wasn't I wasn't getting uh, better um, through some of the other care that I was doing, physical therapy, uh, medication, stuff like that. Um, and oftentimes when I come in here, I'm as tight as a board. Uh, or I'm as stiff as a board. So um, I came to Dr. Ferguson uh, to get some adjustments. Um, and every time I come to Dr. Ferguson, um, I feel a lot better afterwards because I feel a lot more limber. I can turn my neck, I can lift my arms and touch my back. It really helps me when I come in here and then he gives me some adjustments, goes over some things. And I really like how he shows me how the, um, um, like what's going on and stuff. Uh, and he talks to me, uh, I think it's really helpful. So, so I'm feeling good. I feel like I can go out there and, and continue to be me. Um, otherwise, I don't think I would be able to. I, um, I live with addiction, so I can't take painkillers like um, Nor Norco or Oxycontin or Oxycodone or anything like that. Um, Tramadol is even um, um, tricky for me. So I can't take any of these pain medications. So if I take anything, it's usually like Motrin for anti-inflammatory anti um, purposes. And, um, and then I try other things, like I've tried physical therapy, um, but what I would recommend is definitely get with your doctor, um, talk to them about what some of your options are. Chiropractic care might not be the best um, for you, physical therapy might not be the best for you, painkillers probably are not the best for you. But if you talk to your doctor, you can probably start to develop a treatment plan that can actually address the underlying pain. And sometimes the pain in your hip actually comes from something in your shoulder. Or sometimes the, 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 um, the pain in your back comes from something in your hips. So you never know until you actually get it fully assessed. Um, so I would definitely start there and work with your doctor on building a treatment plan that's appropriate for you because it's really individualized care and not just about here's a few pills, take them. You really need a good assessment.